In the first few days of Pride Month, different communities all around the metro area have already reported symbols supporting LGBTQ being stolen. We first heard of this happening in Louisville, but now it's happening in North Glen as well. Sean Chitna is following this story for us tonight, and Sean, neighbors say this only strengthens their pride, especially as towns have recently started their own local celebrations. Karen, and tonight we are glad to say that at this major intersection in Louisville, you can see those flags at all four sides. This is after two separate attempts where people were trying to remove the flags from this intersection. And then over in North Glen, we heard about someone trying to take a sign from a homeowner's yard. In both cases, these are important reminders to make sure these symbols of pride are seen. Christina Semino was excited to start Pride Month with signs the city of North Glen gave her to celebrate. I'm leaving for the morning and I look over and the one in the backyard is completely gone. She showed us how someone had to hop over her fence to grab the sign. I hope people have respect for what's in the yard, but you never know. A disappointing start to Pride Month for a neighbor who is proud to call North Glen home. And this should not be happening. It is really unsettling. She notified police and replaced the sign. This is the first year we've done the decorating of this intersection. Over in Louisville, police got these flags back from the person who stole them. But then someone removed these flags a second time. A nonprofit provided some replacements. We can move past this. Our generation can move past this. The next generation won't have to deal with the same kind of hate. The mayor says there are once again about 500 flags. And now even more people know that they're here and are putting out their own flags in support. It lets people know when they're just passing through, like, you're welcome here. We would love for you to be here. Building even more small town pride across Colorado. It's a really good community for equality and for inclusion of everybody. And speaking of inclusion and passing by, the mayor told us that she heard of a group of travelers who were coming through from another state. They were actually headed to Boulder, but they saw this display, these public flags, and they were so touched by it that they decided to stop here and spend their time shopping and eating in Louisville. Reporting live tonight, Sean Chitness covering Colorado First.